the end of things. What the f Why are you so fixated on me? Because you're my friend. Just give up and let me cut you down already! This world shall go pain. It's time you open up. It's all over. Hello guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Naruto Shippuden episode 478, the final valley battle between Naruto and Sasuke. I think it just reached its conclusion. Very emotional, very, it's kind of slowly paced, but I think they're just displaying raw emotion how they write. And it's just, I, I love how they're doing it, man. And now that was the final blow, definitely. Both of them are out of chakra, and I believe that they, they both might be dead, bro. I don't, I don't know what to expect, honestly. But I couldn't wait. I just took a five minute break, and I'm just jumping right into this, okay? Uh, guys, listen, I ain't gonna make any theories, I ain't gonna do anything. We're just gonna see how this ends, apparently, and, and hope for the best, right? So, that being said, if you enjoy my reactions, feel free to share, subscribe, like, leave a comment, ring that bell for notifications, guys, follow me on Instagram, join my Discord server, and my Patreon, Pedro, without further ado, man. Let's see how this ends, man. Let's go. Naruto, just disappear already and take our bond along with you! He's acknowledging the bond, man. At least something. Make the unison sign, so we can move on. The unison sign again. I mean, this is actually giving me hope, because we know that they didn't do the unison sign here, right? They just continued fighting, but since they're portraying this here, and we know that the battle is ending in real time, maybe they are now finally gonna make that unison sign and kind of resolve the issues, right? Find their own answer together. Yeah. You wanna go, you loser? I remember. Oh, they're watching their memories. What's this? They're connected, man. You and I fight each other. They're... We both will die. Bruh, are they dying right now? What is this? Are they dying right now? They're just oh, okay. I'm telling you, something happened. They're both really injured or something. Just got, they're, they're dying out. They're connected. Every time they exchanged the blow, they, they saw each other's memories and feelings just like during the war arc with Naruto and just, you know, man, that, that's that. Even Hashirama shared through Naruto's chakra. And yeah, this is gonna be at a whole other level emotional, isn't it, man? I have to prepare for tears. Where are my onions? <laughs> Guys, I'm just gonna fast forward you opening we're gonna be jumping right into this because i cannot wait i just have to find out how this ends man okay guys i fast forward in the opening um i think i'm ready so let's go let's see drip drip my dead everything Bro. feels strange so yeah that must be what happened they're dead So, how does the story end? There's... There's no way. They were both you had outcasts. Tenths, and I was in Uchiha. We were ostracized by the village and treated like outcasts. You can't say that I'm wrong. You said I was like your brother. And in that sense, maybe we were brothers. They're connected on a deeper level, man. It's not easy to break. Even in death, apparently. <laughs> I know that I promised. I wouldn't die till... I became Hokage. Man, are they seriously dead? There's no way, man! You're worried about what happens to the rest of the world? Yeah, of course! We can't leave things like that! They'll figure something out. They don't have the ring, I got the sage powers, they don't know, what, what are you talking about? Yeah, but I do kind of, broad. I do find it funny that, right, Sasuke found it funny, so he kind of had that smirk, so that kind of gives me hope that he 
might have, you know, lightened up a bit. But, bro, there's no way they're dead, man. Okay, the Sage of Six Pad said that they're the only ones that can release that jutsu, so... I sure hope so. <laughs> Naruto. What? Bro, what is happening? Did Omni Sasuke die? Or Omni Naruto? I bet pretty soon, they're gonna carve your great stone face up there. What is this theme? It's ominous. I'm getting chills! Forgive me, Sasuke. And whatever you do from here on out, know this. No matter what, I will love you always. <laughs> Bro, what is happening? Big brother. I'll be seeing you. Soon. Is Omni Sasuke dead? What's with the dripping, bro? Please don't tell me that's blood. You finally come too, huh? They're both alive? If either of us moves too much, we'll bleed out and die. What? Bro, they're Why injured. Why go that far? Why do all that? Just to get in my way. You've never attempted to cut me off. I'm the only one who can handle all that hate. Do you understand? Why do you keep on involving yourself with me? <laughs> you know that already. He's your friend, I bro. Mean, come on, don't you? Your body can't move, but your mouth sure can. Just answer me! <laughs> <laughs> He's trolling him. They're about to die. He's trolling him. Because you're my friend. Yeah. I have had enough. What are you? I'm your friend, Sasuke! Because you're my friend. You've told me that before. But what exactly does that mean to you? When I see you, take on stuff and get all messed up, it... kind of... will hurt me. Bruh. It hurts so much inside that I can't just leave it alone. That's a real friend. Damn. Naruto, I knew you were always alone back then. The village shunned you, just like they did with me, the lone Uchiha survivor. The more I watched you being idiotic and getting yelled at over and over, it started weighing on my mind. Back then, that's when I wondered if your weakness was beginning to rub off on me. <laughs> Seeing you desperately trying to bond with others made me remember my own family. Yeah, man. I don't know why, but I felt relief. I considered it a weakness. I trained hard as if to escape that weakness. Yeah, he couldn't let himself feel because it was so crushing, man. Damn, man, you know, and the way they're telling the story, Sasuke and Naruto were very similar. He was the Nine Tails Chinchuriki, and he was in Uchiha. In the end, Uchiha got slaughtered by Itachi because the, the village feared them. So he was the only Uchiha left. Of course, they feared him, but the show never really showed us that side. Ne never really showed us the villagers hating on Sasuke. It was always Naruto. So now, to say it from that perspective, yes, of course, he was also an outcast, man. He was in Uchiha. Yes, the last remaining survivor, but he was still an outcast. They still feared him because he was that one that had the potential to gain that Uchiha power and, and, and hate. So, yeah, they were so similar. It's just the show didn't portray Sasuke as a victim, even though he was this entire time, you know? Then, of course, they had that deep bomb from the very start. They were able to understand each other more than anybody else, but they couldn't get over their pride and just, you know, reach out to each other. Not back then, not like this, but now they had to bumble each other to the brink of death. They can't even move anymore. And it took all of that for them to have an honest conversation, open-hearted, brah. In order to get stronger than my brother, in order to get my revenge, yet I ended up on the same team as you. I started wanting to battle you too someday. 
And I began to see a shadow of my own family in Squad 7. That's right. I too felt pain. He's finally admitting his feelings, bro! When I understood your hurt, I finally saw you as a comrade. Back then, I... I Man. always knew that you were alone, too. All I really wanted to do was to come up to you and start talking. I get sort of giddy. But I never did. So I decided I'd make you my rival. And from that day on, you've been my goal. I wanted to be strong like you, cool like you. I guess that's why I kept chasing after you. It was the opposite. I was the one who was jealous of you. Bruh. You had a strength that I didn't have. You were always walking in front of me. <laughs> like a true Hokage! So is he actually admitting here that Naruto, because Naruto kept saying during this war arc that Hokage is, you know, the one that walks in front of everybody else. And, and you know? So is this actually Sasuke admitting that Naruto deserves to be the Hokage more? And, and throughout this entire series, Naruto always focused on the future, becoming Hokage. And then we had Sasuke who always focused on the past, revenging his parents' death, right? And his clans and, and, and killing Itachi. So it's just a correlation between it. He's finally admitting his feelings and yeah, he always could sense Naruto's strength that he didn't have. He just couldn't admit that to himself, but now he can, man. Just like my late brother. <laughs> like Itachi, bro. And even today, too. You'll have to take care of Sasuke. <gasps> He's seeing his memories. These are Naruto's memories. And my future yeah. dream is to be the greatest Hokage. Then the village will stop disrespecting me and treat me like I'm somebody, somebody important. Don't underestimate me! I don't quit and I don't run! Well, all right! I don't care if I do get stuck at the Genin for the rest of my life! I'll, I'll still be Hokage, Hokage, Hokage one, day. one day! Yeah, man! And I don't go back <laughs> on my word! That's my Nindo, my ninja way! And I will become the greatest Hokage of them all! The Hokage is the one who walks ahead of everyone else, enduring their own pain! So yeah. that's why! A Hokage never walks over his comrades' corpses. Corpses. There's no shortcut to becoming Hokage. Sasuke. This show is amazing. He's seeing everything. All his emotions, feelings, memories, everything. And that's solidifying his decision to making Naruto the Hokage, right? I'm, I'm telling you, they're working their way around Sasuke's feelings. And he's finally gonna accept this bond and embrace it. However powerful you are, don't take it all on yourself. Yeah, exactly! You share. <laughs> it's finally hearing his brother's words that was his mistake that Sasuke just tried to make yet again. And now, when he hears it directly from Itachi's mouth, he's gonna realize the, 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 the man that he needs Naruto, that he needs that family that he saw in Team 7, bro. I mean, come on, if they're willing to accept you after everything you did, of course they're your family. You do share your father's dream, right? Then never forget. Becoming Hokage isn't to get acknowledged. Only those really already acknowledged, acknowledged become yeah, Hokage. Exactly. That's a lesson for you, Sasuke. Big brother. I... <laughs> Yep, here we go again, just like with Obito. Only this time, there's still a chance to save Sasuke. I hope they both survive, honestly. And, and, and Sasuke comes to our side because he's too cool to, to, to be killed off, man, honestly. <laughs> Notice that Tobirama ain't waving because he's in Uchiha. <laughs> I'm kidding. Obito, yeah, Naruto made friends, even in death, man, he sees himself on his side now. That's doubt, my friend, just like Obito. Show me. What? 
Show him what? I thought... It was already decided. Don't tell me it's really heaven this time. Seems we fell asleep <laughs> and slept the whole night through. Bruh. We failed to die yet again. They dreamt together. I was hoping to hit you again <laughs> so I could make you finally open up your eyes for real. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, he's laughing. And not an evil What's laugh. So funny. We're all messed up. And you still want to fight? <laughs> Damn right! Whatever it takes! I admit it. <gasps> that I've... I've lost. Oh! It's actually about punching a sulking friend to make him snap out of it! And the real match that I want comes after doing that! Hey, Naruto? What? Shut up! <laughs> you already won, man. You know, I just acknowledged you. <laughs> if I die here, the long cycle of destiny the sage mentioned might end. Bro, don't die. That's a kind of revolution, too. Fact! I release the infinite Tsukuyomi once I'm dead by transplanting my left eye into Kakashi or someone else. Bro, don't die! No way. Your dying isn't gonna settle things. If you're willing to die, then live and help me instead. Bro! What I want to do is get all shinobi to cooperate. And that definitely includes you. There's no guarantee I won't oppose you. <laughs> then I'll just stop you again. Besides, I know you won't do that anymore. Look, don't make me repeat myself. Bro, he's gonna cry. Bro, I'm crying, Come bro. on, are you seriously not getting it yet? You were always pretty dense. <laughs> he's crying. He's crying. Bro, if Sasuke can cry, I can cry too. Shut up. That's a lot of blood, man. What? They destroyed each other's hand! And the blood is connecting. <laughs> oh my god, they made a unison sign with the blood. Bruh. Bruh. They're bleeding out and I'm clapping, bruh. That's... That's just... Bro. That was the dripping part and all that, bro. The blood. They destroyed each other's hand in that final attack. Oh my god. And they're bleeding out, bro. I really hope Kakashi comes, Sakura heals them or something. They, they, they don't have an arm anymore. So they're not just gonna have an arm? Yeah, I think they're both gonna survive that, bro. Sasuke actually cried. Naruto made Sasuke cry. He told him, I can't guarantee you that I won't oppose you, right? From time to time, just like Madara did with Hashirama, but... Naruto seems confident in their friendship now, and, and then... Man, I'm telling you, this is just... On another level, this was a dope ending, man. This whole episode reminiscing, just going... It, it's a fitting ending, right? Just reminding us of everything that we went through together. Okay, the journey. What a journey, man. What a journey. My mod finally told me that there's uh, 500 episodes of this show, right? And this is episode uh, 478. So there's pretty much 20 more episodes, right? What's it gonna be about? Them rebuilding the village together and everything, right? Forming bonds with other sh nations or something? I'm telling you, they're, they're, bro, they're gonna do it without an arm? I don't know what to say. How is the whole Sasuke thing gonna go? Because he's a fugitive still. They're not just gonna forgive him. I guess that he did save the world. That does deserve some redemption, but still, man. He tried to kill everybody here again, but I guess they're asleep. They can just not tell them. <laughs> bro, I don't know, man. I, I love Sasuke. I really do. I really hope he doesn't die. And I'm assuming he's not gonna die because that's how they ended it off here. He wanted to die, though. I, I have to admit, his plan was dope. Because, yeah, if you think... If you think about it that way, like Indra, if with a Rinnegan you have the power to reincarnate yourself and live forever, he could have done that and just ruled from the shadows like a god. He did have that power, right? Imagine if Sage and Six Pads just stayed forever, right? He could just intervene every time somebody gained some power and just shut that shit down right away, right? And that's how he would rule with an iron fist and there would be peace. He would be forever in darkness alone, not form any bonds and everybody else would just live their lives, you know? 
So that was a dope plan, and I see where he was coming from when, you know, I, a lot of you guys are like, oh, he's emo, he's this, he's dramatic. No, bro, he went so through so much. Nobody asked him anything. You just expect him to just, right? Just, oh, okay, I'm gonna sweep it under the rug. No, he has emotions, man, and this was real. This was realistic. That's what I love about his character. He's way of acting towards certain situations is realistic not everybody's gonna have that strength uh, uh, like naruto to say oh i'm gonna forgive you even though you killed my sensei i'm gonna forgive you even though you right not everybody's gonna do that somebody's gonna be like sasuke most of us would be like sasuke without the rinnegan and all that because we're vicious compared to him but you right so very interesting dynamic i enjoyed it a fitting ending can't wait to see what's next. I have one more episode that I'm about to jump into. And then after episode 479, you guys told me to watch a movie, right? And then, yeah, and you guys told me not to see that end credit scene on, on that movie because it's, it's apparently full of spoilers. I don't know what else there to spoil, but okay. You told me to watch it after I finish the show. So I'll do that. And yeah, guys, that's the plan. Uh, I'll see you on the next one, I guess. Stay safe. Love you, enjoy, bye, I don't know. <laughs> I really enjoyed this episode. Hope you enjoyed the reaction, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Love you.